Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Now this is the uh, Stepford uh, map and uh, yeah I had planned to I think uh, look at this uh, um, oil chain here but um, it occurred to me that I have a bit of a traffic problem and that I might be able to like if you take a look here right so I might be able to alleviate some of that by connecting a passenger rail from uh, Star City Metropolitan here to Minas Tirith. So that is the project for today. Right, okay. So uh, what I'm going to do is uh, add a platform here. But what I'm actually going to do is add two platforms because I think in the future I'm going to need another. Whoops, in here. Um... No, in here. Yep. Uh, is I think I'm going to need another line off of here as well. Like Minus Tirith is going to be some sort of a hub. So I'm going to put two platforms here. And I'm going to, I'm going to shift the existing line uh, to the two new platforms. Uh I don't know why editing a station causes that, but it does. Um, okay, I'm going to stick one of those there, and one of those there, and one of those there for symmetry. And then we'll stick a station roof on. Okay. Now, if we do this, now it's happy, right? But if we do this again, now it's happier. Okay. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move these two tracks over to this these platforms. And then I'm going to run a uh, line out. And I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to run it out and I'll go through the mountain here because, you know, I have ran the game forward a bit uh, to uh, clear the loan and all of that jazz. And it's like 370 million in the bank. So, it, you know, we don't have any issues building something now. Uh, and apologies if I'm a bit sniffly. Uh, air quality when I'm recording this is uh, going down due to uh, forest fire smoke coming in from the west coast of North America. Yeah, or wildfire anyway. Um, okay, so I'm going to shift the, the main, main line here that's already here over to these new platforms. And uh, I'm going to uh, pull off, uh, I'm going to pull off my, uh, I'm going to split my uh, line off here. Uh, so that means I think I'll uh, shift these uh, lines uh, over. Yeah, okay. Uh, so I'm going to need to build uh, uh, new uh, tracks here. So I'll go ahead and do that. And this is going to have to go all the way up and through the tunnel, which we can't do in one go. I do kind of wonder why that happens, but it does. I think it has to do with elevation. Right, so, you know, we're, we're building the these tracks here. Now, while I'm uh, building the tracks, you know, I'll uh, kind of waffle on a bit because, you know, that's what that's what people do. Uh, as you can see, I've got a lot of traffic here. Now, this is partly because of the uh, natural town growth mod, which has dramatically increased the uh, town populations. Uh, and I kind of did that because it's a bit of a challenge, right? So we've got all of this traffic here. And the only way to get rid of that is going to be uh, phenomenal public transport, right? Uh, okay, yeah, that looks fine. Uh, and that's going to take just a little bit of uh, finagling. Now, I need to get this under the bridge connected here. I, okay, now it's time to pause it. Okay, so I'll do this, take this out, uh, and take that out. Yep. Okay. Now, let's see. Can this just connect? It can. Okay, well, I'm going to have to back this up a bit further. And this comes in here. 
Yep. Okay, good. And then I'm going to bring this out here. And this is just so we can fling trains at it. Right? Uh, yeah, that should be fine. And, uh, yeah, I should just uh, double slip that. And then stuff coming out of the... Well, then, then uh, anything coming out of here can get on both tracks, just in case. Okay. And then I'm going to also put one of these here. Just make it a fully capable crossover. And then anything coming out, you know, the... Well, then, you know, just just because. And then I can do turning services there, right? And besides, you know, it gives you more complicated track work. Just, you know, because why not? Uh, now, I need to put the signal back here. Uh, right about there. Okay. Now, I'm going to need some signaling over here. Yeah. And then, I guess, over here. Yeah. And then over here is where I uh, change the, uh, the line, right? Uh, so we do this. Yeah, 283 is fine. Good. Now, I've got... Yeah, okay, so with that there, it should allow the train to get back on track. So, manage the line. Do this. We're good. Okay. Now, let's start things rolling again. Having this here means this train can escape to the right place. Um... Uh, so I'm actually looking like I made a plan or something that might make sense. You know, I mean, that can't be right, can it? Uh, anyway, you know, like we can watch this train here. See, here is this uh, traffic again. So I definitely need to do something about local transport uh, between the cities and in the cities. Uh, so I think I'll probably end up replacing the uh, intercity line here with uh, something a little bit faster. Uh, you know, redo all of this affair here, maybe move to a redo the town and have a major transport hub right in the middle of it. Uh, that might be a, a good project for a future episode is remodeling a town. Yeah, see here we're back on the right uh, the right thing there. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here. We've already got a spare platform. So I'll uh, get... Uh, I had, oh yeah, when I built this bridge, I had planned to be able to bring a track out that way. Uh, so that's kind of good. So we'll do this and do this. Yep. Okay, now I need to get it up to here and I'm just gonna tr uh, see what uh, crow flying it will do and uh, well we can do it oh we get a cheeky little bridge in here what if we make that an embankment yeah and we get a couple tunnels um, okay what's it gonna cost us five million yeah we can take that um, right. So we put the second track in, and it doesn't... Okay, well, we can parallel it there. And then we can come up here. Good. Okay, so, uh, there's a track. Uh, so I'll, uh, chuck in some signals. But yeah, at some point, like uh, I need to get uh, the plan for this map is to get more, uh, uh, more, um, more of the industries connected up. I may end up having to remove the natural growth mod. Uh, I want to just see how bad it gets, right? Uh, 
and you know how big everything gets and uh, and all of that is I kind of want uh, you know a couple of massive megalopolises like here and here uh, like this whole area should uh, should become a massive urban area and I kind of want to see what that looks like right okay uh, that's got the uh, the the train line uh, uh, the the tracks connected so now we just need to chuck a train at it now do we have any decent multi units uh, the Zephyr does 177, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, so we'll just go in for an electric thing here. What's this one? 140, 3000. That's 3450, 160. What's the crew? Okay. Yeah, we'll go with the GG1. Yep. The GG1 uh, passenger, we need uh, carriages. That does 120, that does 180, 150, 120. Um, that's one times load, that's two times load. One time, two times. Do I want to go slower uh, with a, uh, a faster load? Um, or faster with a slower load. You know what? I'm going to just see how this goes. I think I'm going to need a fair amount of capacity here. Uh, oh, that's all it takes it down to mediocre already. What? This is 35 tons. What's this one? 40 tons. Oh. Um... Okay, so that's uh, 191 capacity, but it's it's good. Why is it good? What's now? It's media. What? Um. Okay. Uh, that's mediocre. Top speed. 156 takes forever. Yeah. Um, right. Well, I'm going to try that. I'll uh, replace it with different uh, attraction if I if I need to. Um, okay, so we'll buy one of those. And uh, we'll make a new line, which will go from... Where are we? Minus Tirith, right? From Minus Tirith to Star City Metropolitan. Could not... What? Huh? Where? Who? Oh. I see. Right. Well, let's name the line. It's Intercity Rail. Uh, MT... No. No. Mint to Star City. Yep. Uh, okay. Now let's go in here and actually put a bleeping crossover. Yeah. Uh, that was uh, kind of um, dumb. So we'll do this. Uh, we'll do this with that. And we'll do this. And then we'll do this. And uh, then we'll do this here terminals um, now it doesn't seem to want to connect what did I do um, manage line could not connect all stations hmm Star City Metropolitan. It's on the... Do this. Ah, that fixed it. Okay. Whoops. Let's, um... Let's go in here. Uh... What? Hello? What? What? 
Why are you there? Um, okay, well, I can fix that. I can do a uh, fancy uh, crossover thing here. There we go. Now let's uh, let's just ride this and uh, and see what this looks like. It's going to be mostly in a tunnel, of course. Uh, I should be able to remove that extra crossover. Um, right. Okay. So. Yeah, so the, the kind of the plan here is to uh, maybe fix that track, actually. Uh, the plan here is to uh, get, the, uh, uh, get the traffic under control in these cities. But unfortunately, I think that means the cities will just get bigger, right? So I'm not going to worry too much about it. I just want to make sure that my public transport functions. Okay, so we're going downhill here. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're going downhill. Uh, right. Anyway, uh, I was playing around with a uh, another map that I that I have for uh, just messing about, and I I was uh, trying out different ways to improve traffic and. Uh, Later on in the game, there's an option to build roundabouts, and, you know, it's amazing. Those work amazingly well in the game. Uh, there's just one thing that we need to really make traffic management work well, and that's the ability to specify lane connectors at uh, junction points. If we could specify uh, the turn lane connections... Uh, and lane connectors at junction points, then we could get, really get the traffic humming along nicely uh, for the private vehicles. Unfortunately, we can't do that just just at the moment, and uh, that's slightly problematic. Uh, on the other hand, uh, you know it is a you know it is just a transportation sim type game, so you know it's doing pretty good. Uh, but there would be a massive improvement in uh, traffic capabilities if we could set lane uh, connections manually. Uh, realistically, though, uh, if you you're only going to really run into that problem if you've got a pretty uh, ridiculous uh, uh, population on your map, right? Okay, so we picked up 67 people at uh, Star City Metropolitan. So now we uh, haul our uh, train up the hill. And uh, eventually we'll get up to the summit there. Yeah, definitely be nice when we get uh, some slightly more powerful uh, rolling, uh, well, traction here. Uh, I could have, you know, picked something that had more power too, you know. Uh, drag fewer coaches and uh, put uh, uh, two trains on here maybe. But I just kind of want to see how, the, uh, how this affects the, uh, the traffic, right? This should take a fair bit of traffic off of the highway in between the two towns. And that's kind of what I'm looking for, right? Uh, but it should also carry enough passengers to earn a pretty penny as well. Now, I'll, uh, after uh, this train ride, I'll uh, bring up the line list and we can uh, you know, take a look at, at the, uh, the lines that are making some actual cash. Which was most of them when I, uh, when I checked. Um... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure what the uh, I'm not sure what the the breakdown is now, but I think it was just a few local lines that uh, that weren't turning a profit, and that's fine. Those don't need to. Uh, 
Okay, so uh, we're joining up with the other line here. And uh, here we go. Into the tunnel. And... Uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, I should relay those, those uh, tracks there, obviously. Um, take that crossover out because we don't need it anymore. And uh, here we go. We're going to... I want to see how many passengers are waiting here. Uh, we should get transfer passengers and everything uh, in this uh, scenario. Okay, here we go. We drop off 67. And then we pick up... Forty. Okay. Well, that's okay. I'm just gonna pause it here. I'm gonna take this crossover thing out, so we don't need it. And then I'm gonna relay this track here. Uh, right. Uh, just because it was annoying. Uh, okay. Good. Relay this one. Good. That definitely is better. Yeah, way better. Whoops. Uh, okay. Uh, you get moving again. Now, I want to check uh, check out here. Uh, what do we need here? I think we've got, we've got a lot of traffic coming up over to Swallow Falls. Now, I think I was thinking I might take another line out of Minas Tirith and run it up to Swallow Falls. I think the idea, it run it up through Swallow Falls and then maybe up through Hill Valley and Gotham. And uh, this one can continue up to Winchesterton Fieldville and uh, maybe pick up, um, was it Pork Belly and uh, Metropolis. And the uh, Gotham City one can come up through Emerald City into Metropolis. Um, or we can come from Pork Belly through Emerald City as well and make Emerald City a hub. I might do that, actually. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, what I do know is as soon as I connect up more towns with public transport, it's going to uh, increase the population of the existing towns. Like, you take a look at this. Uh, Grand Fenwick and uh, Elmore have... Uh, pretty much grown together now uh, and Wakanda and Elmore have definitely merged and it won't be long before Arkham joins the party right so um, yeah it's uh, definitely uh, gonna be a, a significant uh, urban area here uh, it may be that I end up uh, adding in more uh, more trains going in every which way too uh right okay so uh if we drop in here i definitely need better connections into chester's mill from uh where's the traffic coming fr from is it from minus tirith or is it from pleasantville maybe i need to run a line through pleasantville ah yeah maybe so maybe if I bring a line through Pleasantville and uh, but where do I bring it out over to here? Where would where would I can how would I connect that? I'd obviously come out of uh, uh, Arkham here and I'd come up maybe can I get a train up there I think that's the problem it's the elevation difference maybe I could huh right yeah that's the problem it's the elevation difference well let's see if I can get it up from Chester's mill 
So I would be coming up from here. Uh, can I get up? No, I can't. That's why I haven't. Okay, so what I'll, what I'll need to do is uh, is uh, do something else here, and uh, yeah, because it doesn't make sense to to run the train through uh, minus Tirith. I don't think there. So I just need to. Well, yeah, I I I might be able to to slot something in along the. Uh, freight line here. Can I get a... Uh, can I get a track over to the freight line and then drop a small station in here? I wonder. I wonder. Okay, I just want to I want to check something here. Can I get a track from here to here? Too much slope. Collision. Can I get... Ooh! I can! Okay, well that's the new project. Uh, I'm going to uh, I'm work on that now. It's going to require relaying a bit of this. But... What I'm going to do is uh, buildings. I'm going to put a passenger station with one track. Um, two tracks, actually, because then I can bring it down to uh, to minus Tirith as well. I can I, I can definitely get. No, I can't. That that's maximum downsloping there. Okay, so if I get get a, a station in here. How's the uh, elevation here? Um, if I do it with one track, I can get it in. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's pretend the track is coming in this way, like this. Okay. Uh, now, if I take that out. I can I can peel it off and come here. Yeah, okay. Now, if I try to to slot one of these in. Yeah. Uh we'll make it high speed. Um okay, so if I take that off uh, I think I want to bring it uh, tracks uh, over this way. Like that. Okay, building. Can I stick it in? No, that's too close. Okay. Well, let's stick this in where I want it. I've got Good. That will get me... Yep. Okay. And track. Track. Okay, now. Okay. That, I think I can make work. Uh, right. Good. So you come out here. Like this. Now, get... Okay. I can get you across. Yeah. Bridge pillar collision with what? Okay. Well, I'm going to have to obviously get rid of these guys. Okay. I think I'm going to single track this one. We'll just run a single shuttle train back and forth along here. Uh, okay, you come down. Can... Oh, it fits. Yeah, if I run a single shuttle train through here, 
I can make this work. Okay, so we need to... You need to go away, right? Track. You need to come around like that. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so this will be a shuttle, which will uh, just uh, run up there. Uh, and this is a shorter one, so I can configure this. Uh, you, one, two, three, uh, four. Now, can I, I can fit the platform length in there. Yep. Good. What happens if I go in here, configure uh, passenger buildings, side building, put that there. Yeah. Yeah, that's that looks better. Right. Okay. Now we uh, do our thing, which is tracks. Uh, this needs to come out to say there and then out to there. Now, if I put a crossover in here, I should be able to uh, I put a full crossover in here. I should be able to get a uh, train on here. Uh, where would it be coming from? Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to put the crossover uh, as a uh, as a thing there. Uh, as a thing, yeah, uh, it's uh, definitely uh, definitely what it is, a thing, and I'm actually going to put the uh, depot, wait, where's the, oh, never mind that, I can actually uh, do this, yeah. Let's just do that. Okay. So that will allow me to get a uh, train on there from this depot. Uh, that will require electrifying this part. So I will do that uh, here. Uh, yeah, I'll just electrify this bit. Uh, up to the crossover point uh, there and there yeah okay so that'll let me get a, a train out of the depot here so I'm going to run a now what multiple units do we have we have the Zephyr which uh, has a capacity of 52 and no power um, uh, that is, uh, yeah, um, and that is, uh, well, the Zephyr's better. You know what? I'm going to add a Zephyr on there. Um, yeah, and, uh, we'll buy it and, uh, new line. I'm going to pause while I set up the line. Uh, you will go here to here. Yeah. And that's going to be uh, ICR, and that's going to be some, some Grand Fenwick to Pleasantville. Yeah? Okay. Now, we're going to ride this one. Whoops. Oh, come on. Uh, where is it? There it is. There it is. Now we're going to ride this one out onto the line. Um, now the Zephyr is not electric, 
but uh, I figured I'd electrify this because ultimately I'm going to be running an electric multi-unit on there. So, uh, yeah, I just want to have some variety of rolling stock running. Uh, you know, that's half the fun here. Uh, oh, look, it's autosave. Uh, and here we go. Uh, right. This is definitely going to be the, you know, after this uh, ride here, that's definitely going to be the end of it. The part here. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I'll uh, see what, uh, what I need to be doing about things here. Yeah, it's getting a decent speed up. I could always run two Zephyrs in a in a chain, uh, you know, in a single consist. Um, okay, here now we're we're seeing the uh, crossover. Now let's see how it does the crossover. Oh, because of that signal there, it has to do it right. And we got a post in the middle of the track. Yeah, that's a thing. Okay, now we're on our line. I'll probably have to double track this at some point. Uh, but we were able to uh, stick a single track in there without uh, any uh, complications. So that, uh, that just made it the, uh, the good option, right? Now, I wonder if I can get it down to minus Tirith um, also. I'll probably have to helix it. Uh, but that's uh, something to, uh, to consider, I think. Uh, then I'm going to have to rejigger the uh, public transport in the, uh, in the town here. We do have passengers turning up here, though, so uh, there will be some usage of this link. So, so that's good. Yeah, okay, uh, that's good. Uh, so I'm going to have to uh, redo the uh, public transport in uh, in the towns. Now, uh, I'll do Pleasantville off camera, I think, uh, before the next part. Uh, just. Uh, uh, you know, I'll, I'll do it and then I'll show you what I did uh, because I think uh, I'll be changing it to have a major bus or, or road vehicle terminal here. And uh, and then, yeah, that's probably what I'll do. Uh, yeah. And then a major bus link can come down into uh, Chester's Mill. I think that would probably make all the difference on the traffic so yeah uh, now is it uh, well you know it's gonna move some some passengers back and forth so so that's definitely not bad yeah okay uh, so uh, overall uh, that's uh, we got uh, we got a link over into uh, here. Now I just want to check in on the traffic here, and it's still crazy. Although it might actually be reducing, because this is all all the built up traffic, so it might be reducing. Uh, and in case you're wondering, I have a traffic light enabled here, uh, and it's just because of the volume of traffic, uh, different ro the, d the directions were starving out. Uh, it was deadlocking. So, yeah. And I'm going to need, obviously, transport into, into Swallow Falls. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well. So far, so good. Uh, so far, so good. 
uh, I think maybe I do do want to try and extend this down to uh, uh, to minus Tirith. You know that uh, definitely won't harm anything, and it'll take some of the uh, passenger traffic off of uh, other things, and maybe I could bring one down from there into Chester's Mill as well. Yeah, maybe, maybe. I'll have to think about it. Anyway, I need to fix up the local uh, transport before I can uh, before I can uh, fix anything else. So. Uh, yeah, so that's going to be all for this part. Uh, I'll probably do some major uh, rejigging off camera uh, for the uh, local transport, and then we'll see where it goes. Uh, so I guess, uh, you know, that's all for now. Uh, you know, I'll be back next week with another episode, and, uh, you know, stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. I mean, it looks like it's going to be ongoing for a while, so, you know, don't let it get you down too much, man. And then, uh, yeah, see you back next time.